have some 168 grain Sierra Match King boat tail hollow points from Federal Premium Gold Metal. We're going to try those out and see what the difference is. That's what we're hoping for. So, let us get set up and ready. camera down there that is filming the target. So that will be nice. I get to see the bullet holes hit. See how accurate Mr. Epstein can be today. Or how inaccurate. It's a very calm day. Maybe three, two, three, four mile an hour wind hitting every once in a while. Pretty mellow, pretty calm. So let me take a look down here and see how that works. Okay, yeah, it just went over slightly. So that's one shot on the target that is two, two inches high, which is correct for 200 yards. But it appears to be to the left slightly. Let's see if we can get this follow-up shot to confirm. key hold. Very interesting. I'll try one more. <laughs> Here we go. Third shot. Very nice. Okay, so if that's true, and they key hold about that far up from the bullseye, and about that far over to the left of the bullseye. So I'm gonna change my impact to the right by one, two, three, four, that's a quarter inch. One, two, three, four, that's a half inch. Let's see how that does. So we got one fouling shot and three in a group that basically key hold, which is very nice. And let us see about our next three rounds after a slight adjustment. So we can get those to be two to three inches, just almost three inches above the bullseye at this 100 yard range will give us a dead on accurate bullseye at 200 yards. So here we go. We have made an adjustment. We're going to see if we can get centered now. Okay. That did go over to the right, but it seems like too much. It might have just been me. Let's see if I just pulled that one. Let's try it again. Did we pull it? Let's see. Bring this 
back to the left, I did a double, so I'm going to do a single. What I mean is four increments, so I'm going to back off one increment. Take it back to the left. One, two, three, four. Okay. So that three shot group was pretty good. Two key hold and one just outside of them. So now let's rest the gun for a moment and take a walk down here and take a look. <clears throat> so, absolutely wonderful day today out here in the southwestern desert of the United States. It is a little warm. It's like 94 degrees today. That's why I have my shade. Helps out a lot. Faux show. Let's see what we got with these shots I took down here. There's the camera baking in the sun. My little winch, my sunshade fell off. I have to fix that. Okay, so there is three rounds, one, two, three. There's two and three. So I moved over one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight clicks. Now I'm moving back to four, so hopefully that'll get us right where we need to be. But that is about the perfect height to get sighted in for 200 yards. So now we're gonna move over to this target, and then we'll move over to that one for another couple of three round groups. Excellent. Okay, so it's pretty fair from looking at the uh, target down there that these bullets, the Federal Match, are definitely much, much better than the other ones that I was using. They are grouping very tightly. No problems there. So, that is probably one of the big reasons that my accuracy has been suffering is because those loads may not be as accurate as these are. Certainly not as grouping as tightly. But let us... Let's move to our next target and see what we got on that side. Try and group three nice ones over there. <laughs> okay. Load the bipod. Oops, we got our bipod out of our catch. Okay, there's we got our loaded bipod. Got the shoulder power in there. Kind of gentle. I'll lay the feet flat. <sighs> Breathe. seeing these holes down here but um, it's kind of a dirty target so I can't really exactly tell where the holes are but I think that they're at the top let's check and see yep yep those are towards the top of the target about three inches high, yeah. They're still grouping pretty good. OK. 
Okay. Let's let this let's let this rest for a moment. Get some coffee. Yes, we drink coffee out in the blazing sun in the desert. One more on the steel. Here we go. Nice. Very nice. Looking just as beautiful as can be. It is springtime in the desert. Isn't that pretty? Just beautiful yellow.